since it is quite literally 118 degrees outside where I live, yeah, it is clearly full-blown summer here. So I thought to celebrate that, I would show a little bit of a fun bathing suit try-on haul. I know you all love seeing these videos. And I've been wanting to try some of these brands for a while now. I've got a one-size brand in there. I've got a brand that everyone tries that I've been wanting to try forever. I've got a collaboration with one of my favorite black creators. So I feel like it's just a very wide variety of suits to choose from. I'm kind of stepping outside my comfort zone with a few of these, so we're gonna try them on, see how they go. I'm going to give you my honest opinion as always. I purchased all of these with my own money. Nothing was sponsored at all whatsoever, but if any of these brands want to reach out, you know where to find me. And if you don't, it's in the description. I also just want to showcase that you don't have to have any specific body type to look amazing in a bathing suit this summer. Um, you can wear a bathing suit in the body you currently reside in and have a fantastic time. And if it's something that you're struggling with at the moment, maybe me showing you what my body looks like in a bathing suit will hopefully inspire you to want to try it on for yourself. You don't have to buy new bathing suits for this at all whatsoever. You can totally use what you already have, but I just thought that I would play dress up a little bit today. So let's go ahead and just jump into the bathing suits and try them on. All right, so first off, we are going to start with Swimsuits for All, which is a brand that I've known about for many years. I've ordered from them before, and it's pretty much become a tradition that every year I order a new swimsuit, or a few swimsuits, from the Gabby Fresh for Swimsuits for All campaigns. She does these every single year. She drops a collection, and they're always so, so cute and very size-inclusive, plus-size friendly. So I saw this bathing suit on somebody's stories. I honestly can't remember who, but I immediately ran over to the site and picked this up. I'm obsessed with it. I will say, I think this is a site-wide thing at the moment, but Swimsuits for All is having like major shipping delays. I believe this swimsuit I ordered in the middle of May and it's now currently the end of June. It is here now and it is all white. I'm feeling very brave apparently. So this is like a three piece, it's not a two piece, it's a three piece with the option of it being a two piece bathing suit. So we'll start with the bottoms. These are just a plain white high-waisted bottom. I did order these in a size 16. I'm looking at them and they do seem a little small. So I don't know if these run small, but again, I'm just kind of looking at them. I'm not sure. So yeah, the white bottoms. And then on top you have the classic triangle bikini top, which I have not worn one of these since probably the eighth grade so that'll be interesting normally with a bathing suit like this I'd be like no 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 you know if you've watched my channel and have seen me trying enough bathing suits that I love a long line moment I do not really love things that cut off right here but that's where the third piece comes in so this third little piece is a mesh top that goes over the bikini top so cute. I ordered the top in a size 14 because a lot of times, especially when I'm shopping plus sizes, if I shop a size 16, it's like way too big in the chest. So we're going to see how this goes. It does look like a good size. It's going to cover up the ladies. I don't think I've ever worn white bathing suit bottoms because that's terrifying, but I'm feeling brave. So let's try this on and see what it looks like. Here's the thing. I have so many thoughts starting off. First of all, love this. Love the way it looks. I'm absolutely obsessed with the top and like the way that the halter kind of pokes out of like the top of the collar here. That is so freaking cute. Um, I do have underwear on underneath this, just in case you were wondering for all of these, I'm just gonna, you know, in case I need to return them. So if you do see my underwear poking through, just keep it moving. Everything up here is perfect. Fits amazing. I love the way it looks. This material is actually really soft. I'm curious to see if you would still get like tan lines. I don't know if this would maybe be more of like a nighttime jacuzzi type of bathing suit, but it is is very very cute and I actually love the white I think it looks so adorable but what I will say is these bottoms are pretty tight they're pretty pretty tight so I would need to go up to a size 18 and I definitely like have worn size 18 things before in like vintage items or if I'm sizing up for a more oversized fit in something but I am typically a size 16 and this 16 is like pretty tight like I don't know if you can see but it is definitely kind of tight there on the waist it is very supportive I will say say. Um, so keep that in mind if you're looking for something like kind of compressive. I don't know who would want a compressive bathing suit, but who knows? For those of you that are like me and don't like that triangle cut, or at least the super cut off bathing suit top, putting this over, it kind of covers the area that you want to cover, but it still gives you the illusion. And I don't know, like this is actually kind of perfect. All of these bathing suits are going to be linked in the description box below, by the way, in case you want to check them out. But yeah, like 
This is actually amazing. I'm obsessed. Next up, we have a brand called Mod Cloth, and I'm pretty sure I had initially seen this brand. I mean, I've seen it everywhere, obviously, but I'm pretty sure that when I saw this brand most recently featured, it was on my friend Rosie Blair's Instagram stories. We all know my love for her. She is like literally the influencer of my life. I buy everything she recommends. Truly. So I want to say I saw her talk about maybe one of these swimsuits and then I started browsing and then here we are. I had two in my cart. It's what happened. So this first one I got because of Pride. Obviously, it's still Pride Month when I'm filming this. It's my first Pride, even though I haven't done anything because it's too hot in Arizona. And they didn't really have like an official Pride in LA this year. So next year we'll get them. But I picked up this rainbow number, which like looking at it, I'm just so obsessed. I love it so, so much. But... I'm not gonna lie, I tried it on. It's a little too small, which I'm really sad about. I was trying desperately to find reviews because Mod Cloth has reviews on a lot of their items and you can see where people say they run small, they run big, they are true to size, whatever. And I couldn't find anything, I think, because this is pretty new. And so I kind of just went for it. So like at Target, I am a size extra large in the bathing suits, made well, size extra large. So I decided to go for an extra large with this, but it is a little bit big. So I would recommend sizing up just my personal opinion. It's such a cute pride moment. I really wanted to have a cute pride photo, but I don't know, we'll just see. I'll let you know what it looks like on and then we can go from there. All right, here we have our pride moment. She is here, she is queer. I actually do love this, like trying it back on again. Honestly, now that I've tried these bottoms on as compared to the last pair, these don't feel nearly as tight because that last pair was like very tight. So it's still wearable for sure, but I think I would just be more comfortable in a size up. It does feel like my boobs are like trying to eat this bathing suit, um, which is a problem I have a lot. And then the bottoms are great. Like they're pretty full coverage, honestly. I'm absolutely obsessed with the color scheme. Also, please don't mind the line for my underwear down here. We're just we just got to deal with that right now. I am going to probably return this and then purchase a size up if it's still available. Again, it's like, I'm just keeping my fingers crossed for that. Still love it. Still going to wear it. Just need to size up in it. Even though that one didn't work out, we have a winner on our hands. Oh my goodness. So this is actually what made me place this order. I am so obsessed with this swimsuit and it is... Are you actually joking? This is the cutest swimsuit of my entire life. So this is a one piece that is honestly like the most perfectly crafted one piece I think I've ever worn in my entire life. It covers all of the areas you want it to cover. It goes up super, super high waisted. So there's really just like a little peekaboo area in the front. It almost kind of looks like it's a two piece, but it's actually a one piece. It's the best thing ever. There's shoulder straps. There's like a little hook in the back and then it's kind of open in the back as well. It's very full coverage. It's just so cute. I do think you would even have pretty good luck with this if you had larger chests. So I'm obsessed with it. I literally can't wait any longer. We have to put it on because I have to show you it's my new favorite bathing suit of life. I mean, you see it. You see it. This bathing suit is magical. Um, it's like the, if I could design the perfect bathing suit and what I would want to show and not show, this would be it. I love the comfort and ease of having this be a one piece and having like the ability to just move around and do whatever and not feel like things are gonna pop off or like tops are gonna fly up, but also that there's like a little bit showing so that it feels kind of edgy, kind of sexy, a little bit like a two piece. It has like a really cool kind of like folded over moment here. So it is almost like it's a high-waisted two-piece, but then it just kind of folds over like this. So like the sides aren't showing, which I actually do really love as well. It has a huge cutout in the back. It just looks so cute and it is very full coverage for those of you that are looking for more of like a modest swimsuit. I just think this is perfect. The print, the fit. This 1X is like a little roomy, but I actually kind of like that. I mean, I don't like a super, super tight bathing suit, so I would actually prefer it to be slightly more roomy than too tight. This is definitely going to be my go-to bathing suit this summer. If you follow me on Instagram, you might have seen it shown when I went to Palm Springs with my friends last week, and it was honestly just my favorite look of the entire trip. I loved it. Also, if you want to see some outfits that I wore on that trip, I will link a video right up here where you can see some hot girl summer outfits in action. But yeah, this is definitely like, it was perfect for Palm Springs. Definitely that vibe for sure. I could just sit here and talk about it for 10 more minutes, but all I'm going to say is just that it's perfect. I love it. I'm obsessed. There's nothing I would change about it. 
this is the one like this is the one and for the last brand we are going to try i purchased two suits from a site called you swim and here they are i have never worn them i have not tried these on this was actually a brand that was extremely recommended by you all a lot of you requested that i try this out because you swim claims to have a one size type of vibe for their swimsuits. However, they do cut off the sizing right before my size. So I feel like we're really rolling the dice here. Their claim is that their bathing suits fit everyone from a US size two to a US size 14. Now that's not one size fits all, that's one size fits a few sizes. So I'm hoping that in the future they will expand their sizing. I do remember seeing someone that I follow on Instagram, I can't remember who that works with them and says that they are working on that. But I thought I would give it a try because I'm just so, that like really just made me curious. So I picked out two, like I said, the first one is this really gorgeous, like kind of sage mossy green color. And this is a two piece. So here is what the top looks like. This is very reminiscent of those like scrunchy t-shirts from the early 2000s. Um, let's hope this stretches. So it's a long line tank bra type of, there's no support by the way, type of top that is very, very stretchy, I will say. So we're gonna see how this goes because again, cuts off at a 14, I'm a 16. I don't know, but I do really, really love this color. I actually love all of the colors that they have. And then here is the bottoms. Um, definitely a little tinier than I would prefer, but again, it might just completely stretch out and surprise me. I don't know, we're gonna see. <laughs> I'm very curious about it, so let's try this on. Okay, so this one is okay. I like the way it looks. I'm looking at the mirror. I like the way it looks in the mirror. I like the way it looks on camera. I just, the only thing is I wish that I could order like a size up because it does feel like I'm kind of, I still have room, but I am like stretching this out quite a bit. And also again, you can kind of see the line from my underwear right here, but we're gonna ignore that. So yeah, I, I like it. I think right here in the hips too, it definitely feels like it's, it's, it's stretching out quite a bit, which is fine. Like it still fits me. I don't think there's anything wrong with it in particular, um, but I just, especially on the bottoms, like the top feels fine. The bottoms, I do kind of wish that they would be a bit bigger, which is interesting because usually when I order swimsuits, I make the mistake of ordering them all too big. And now I ordered a lot of them too small. I think I'm gonna keep this and still wear it because there's nothing I can do size wise. This is like, this is, this is their sizing. And it really only goes up to a size 14, which isn't even the standard of the average American woman. The average American woman's size is anywhere from a 16 to 18, which is kind of where I lie. So eh. I love the color. I love the cut of it. I do find it interesting that none of the bathing suits that I saw have any kind of support. So you're kind of just free flowing out here. But for me, honestly, like the way that it cuts and sits, it fits fine. The feel of the material is really cool. Like it's extremely ribbed and I actually really like the way that this feels. It's like a waffle material almost. I really love the top. I'm kind of eh about the bottoms and we have one more of these to try on. So we'll see how this goes, but I really do hope and keep my fingers crossed that they are going to expand their sizing because this is definitely better off fitting like someone who's like a size eight, 10, 12 but I tried. And last but not least, we have the same type, it's all the same type of material, I think. They're all seamless, so they say, I mean, I definitely see a seam, but it says that they're very flexible, we love that. I do see quite a bit of diversity in the models, not in the body size aspect, but this is a one piece in this insanely gorgeous purple color and it's definitely my summer color. So I had to get it in a bathing suit and I'm very curious because this quite literally looks like a leotard that I would have worn when I was like five. I don't know, we'll see. I don't think I can wait any longer so let's see what it looks like. Let's end this on a good note. All right, so very mixed thoughts on this as well. Like when I first put it on, I was like, oh no, 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 no. No, 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 no. And now that I'm looking at it a little bit more, it's okay. The thing that I will say is I think because I am like stretching it to its limits, I feel like it exposes a lot of my, like I kind of look naked. Um. <laughs> to me anyway. I feel like you can see a lot of, a lot of what's going on under here. I just feel a bit exposed. So I'm sure that if it wasn't as stretched out, it would be a little bit more full coverage. It's not a hundred percent for me, but it may be for you. So that's kind of why I wanted to try it out. So it is just like a very simple scoop back. It actually does feel like 
a leotard that I would wear when I was younger. It kind of feels like I'm squeezing into that one from when I was younger as well, so I guess I was kind of correct with my prediction, but it's the most tight right here around the hips, so again, not sure what's up with this sizing thing, but I just don't think that the sizing is like 100% for me, which is unfortunate because that's not very inclusive at all. If an average person can't wear it, then it is kind of reserved for smaller people, so keep that in mind, but love the color. The color is beautiful. I just don't know if like like the cut, it's just, I don't feel like it's doing much for me, but that's just my own personal opinion. I feel like with swimsuits that are kind of just like straight like this, like there's really not anything going on. There's no cuts, there's no like ties, there's no peepholes. I just don't feel like those look the best on me. Whereas the one from Mod Cloth, for example, that has like the little cutout, and like the cutout in the back and the straps and like the little tie in the front. I just feel like that looks a lot better on me. I like when it has a little bit more going on, but if you are looking for like a simple or even like a bodysuit, like wearing this as a bodysuit, throwing on some jean shorts. This would be adorable. I would need to wear a strapless bra with this because I feel a little nippy. There's nothing wrong with nipples, by the way. Like, show your nipples. Many people have them and it's great if you do or you don't, but I just personally love like a more smooth, that's where I feel the most comfortable. Not the worst thing I've ever seen in the entire world, but definitely room for improvement. So I hope you all enjoyed this video. If you did, be sure to give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. You can also turn on my post notifications if you wanna be notified every time I post a new video. Let me know if there are any other bathing suits that you want me to try out. I know I get a lot of requests for a lot of different things, but I slowly but surely wanna make my way through them and kind of test out what you all wanna see. So definitely leave those in the comments below. What were your thoughts? Which were your favorites? I definitely know I have mine. And just please remember that no matter what your body looks like, you have every right and you are entitled to having a hot girl summer in your bathing suit. It doesn't matter what you look like. Who gives a shit what other people think about what you look like in a bathing suit? No one's even thinking about that anyway. So please just put on the bathing suit and have the best summer ever. I'll get off my soapbox now. I love you all so much. Thank you so much for watching this video and I will see you in my next one. Bye. Wear the bathing suit, please. Love you.